Well, he just played at Whiskey Jam in Nashville and opened for someone pretty big. You're going to like the name of this. Say hello to Ryan Perry. We are in for a treat today. Hi, Ryan. Hey, how are you doing? I'm fantastic. Yeah. So you just opened for Tracy Lawrence. Yes, ma'am. That was uh, probably one of the biggest highlights of my career. Uh, 12,000 people staring at you and uh, wondering if you, you got what it takes to captivate a crowd that size. So Any any nerves when you go out and you see and you're looking around like, oh, wow, this is... Yeah, I tried not to look, um, you know, and then about an hour before we went on, my manager come back and was like, there's already 8,000 people out there and they are not, you know, she kind of predicted maybe 10,000 by the end of our set, you know, before Tracy goes on and, and I tried not to look out front and walked out and there was, I mean, just as far as you could see both ways. And uh, not really a whole lot of nerves as far as like confidence, because I had confidence in our product and right. my group and my guys and everything. It's just wondering like, you know, here's what we work for is time. It's, our it's shot. now Let's or never, it. you know. Let's so that's, that's kind of where we went with it, you know, do it or don't. That's where it's at. You know? And what was it like kind of opening for someone like an icon like Trace Norris? Uh, He's been in the country you know, world for forever. It was definitely a humbling experience, uh, you know, to be to be there. I mean, and in the mix with somebody of that level. Uh, tons of respect for Tracy Lawrence. You know, I remember watching YouTube videos of you know artists like Jason Aldean and Luke Bryan covering his music uh -huh. acoustic in front of you know 50,000 people and stuff. And then that's where I actually learned about Tracy Lawrence and uh, Time Marches On, his, yeah. one of his biggest hits. And uh, you know, I just. I was like, man, this is the guy, you know, this and I'm, I'm here opening for him, you know, just him and I on the marquee, you know, I couldn't, I couldn't believe it. So it was kind of just one of those wow factor moments, like, you know, we're actually doing something right, you know, so Absolutely. very lucky. Absolutely, Brian, where are you from? I'm from uh, east of Asheville, a uh, small little town called Swannanoa. Okay. And the locals call it Swannanowhere. <laughs> and it's just a tiny little town, um, you know, but I reside now south of Asheville in Hendersonville. I love it. And what are you hoping becomes of this? Um, really just, um, you know, I don't have to be, you know, super big time famous next country icon or anything like that. You know, I just, I, I consider myself successful if I can just support my family yeah. through music. Right. You know, I love playing good country music for good people, meeting new people, having a great time, writing good songs and just seeing people sing along to them, you know, and that's pretty much success for me, you know, and I can go home and lay my head down at night and pay my bills with that music money and that's it. And wake know? up knowing you're getting to do something that you love. You play it. so many shows throughout our mm -hmm. area. Go to his website and follow him on social media. It's probably the, the way to keep up with the most current stuff because mm -hmm. you have a ton of them coming up now. And you're going to be releasing another new single this fall? Uh, yes, ma'am, called My Hometown. Okay. So, and that one goes out to everybody from my hometown, Swannanoa, Black Mountain area. That one's for y'all. So. I love that. Okay, let's go ahead. And is that what you're going to be playing for us yes, today? Yes, ma'am. Yep. I love it. Y'all are going to enjoy this. Ryan Perry, make sure you're following him, ryanperryofficial.com. And let's listen to his new single, My Hometown. Just a blue collar boy never got to stay right on track. For minimum wage, no chance of college because of my GPA. Raise a little hell on them Friday nights with a fake IDs and two fists to fight. Mine, my, my time, but damn, I felt alive. I try not listening to the devil on my shoulder, but when it's hot, that beer's a little colder. The shorts got shorter, the legs got longer. I couldn't help but fall right back to that neon moonlight late night party. When a yell last call, we were just getting started. Someday maybe I'd settle down, but I was just living the dream in my hometown. Black Mountain, a fair view of ten miles of stories. Between the two football rivals, the church view Bibles, heartbreaks, man, I had a few. Middle of nowhere to be found, doing three for deal. As you pass it around, trying to make sense of the next road I go down. I try not listening to the devil on my shoulder, but when it's hot, that beer's a little colder. The shorts got shorter, them legs got longer. I couldn't help but fall right back to that neon moonlight late night party. When a yell last call, we were just getting started. 
thought it someday maybe I'd settle down But I was just living the dream in my hometown Flying down those gravel roads No place to be but always had to go I try not listening to the devil on my shoulder But when it's hot, that beer's a little colder Shorts got shorter, them legs got longer I couldn't help but fall right back to 